Hi guys, I'm Random Trashy. This is another update video. Um, I previously did do a video and an unboxing of the Armasite Spark Core. There has been tons and tons of comments that have been sent about this. Um, not as much on the video, but more personal questions. Would I rate it? Would I, you know, would I? Can I show some footage from the camera? Um, sorry if it's a bit noisy. I'm just getting it out of the box. Um, and have I used it out on site? So this is the unit itself. If you don't know about this, it comes from a company called Armasite that are based in America. Um, it's called the Spark Core. It's a Gen One Plus. Uh, night vision unit um, but please don't dismiss it or leave the video on radio because, because I do have a lot to say about it. I compared this to a pair of PVS 7s that a friend of mine has and although uh, his were slightly brighter I would definitely say that the footage from this or the footage through this is, is much sharper. The issue that I have had is that I record with a DSLR camera you know like a big Canon thing um, and this eye cup on the back and the way that the focal um, focus works with this kind of focal adjustment ring on this end and then you've got kind of your objective focus here it is very very difficult to get good footage for it and I think that's what really lets this down I looked around on YouTube um, a lot trying to find some good footage of this unit and some good footage through it and a lot of people have kind of got their iPhone pretty much like this um, and put it up to the back like that and then tried to get some footage through it the thing is, this is adjusting focused while this adjusts focus while this adjusts focus. Trying to get all of those aligned correctly and, and kind of done right is very, very difficult. But what I will say about this unit is if you are not going to go and spend £3,000 on PVS 14 Gen 3 or Gen 2, at least a decent Gen 2, I would heavily recommend this unit. I paid about £400 to get this to the UK. Um, and I've done a night op recently at the Sandpit, so any of the local airsofters very much, thank you very much for watching the channel and welcome. Um, I went to the Sandpit, there was a night op, flipped this down and had an amazing experience being able to see in the dark. Okay, it's all just with one eye and I didn't have IR on my gun, so it's kind of a little bit hit and miss. But just moving about at night and actually being able to see when a lot of people can't, is a massive, massive bonus, and I'm very, very impressed with what I'm a site have managed to deliver in such a rugged, robust little case um, with plenty of attachment points. So, you know, you can I'm gonna mount it to my gun probably this way, um, so like top way up. It's got the IR built in, it runs on uh, one of the CR123 batteries, so everyone has them when you're at an airsoft uh, game because they what power your pet boxes and your torches and all that sort of stuff. So, you're never gonna run out of batteries. It's got built in IR. Um, a very very good range of focus for such a cheap unit but uh, you know and the, the level of illumination um, is not far off what you would get off Gen 2 it, I mean we're not talking like a quarter off it's like you know a tenth or a fifteenth off of what you're going to get from a Gen 2 um, unit if you do decide to get PVS 7s or PVS 14 a acquired ex-military one you don't have any hours on that tube, you don't get any guarantee. I'm sure the person that you buy it off is probably going to be taking, I would imagine, about £1,400 off your hands. And I'm sure they're not going to give it back to you in six months' time if it goes wrong or you get some degradation of the tube or there's some burn spots in it that weren't advertised, whatever. There's a lot of you know complications with it. I went to Optics Planet, I spoke to the help service, asked them if I could get one of these into the country. Because of I'd asked some questions about it, they gave me 10% off, which covered the shipping cost. And I got it into the UK, and I think I paid about 30 or 40 pounds shipping tax and handling. You really can't argue, that's two years also worth of guarantee. So if you do send it back, they will cover the charges, repair it, and then send it back for you for free. You really can't. You can't argue at those sort of specs, um, to the point of two of the guys from my team have now gone and bought these units because they were that impressed with them. And you're not massively out of pocket. They're also selling on Amazon for about £600. I got mine into the country for four, say I've used it three times at night, maybe. Um, you're going to still make profit on it. Um, armor site, well done. I mean, great. You know, you guys have done something. Um, phenomenal so congratulations I guess um, it's a great unit um, I will try and get some footage through it hi guys here's some footage from the early hours of this morning 
Um, loads of cloud cover last night. It was very, very dark. As you can see, my Canon is picking up no footage at all. Just a few lights in the distance. When I hold the unit in front of the camera, you can see out to the end of the garden, about 80 feet. It's nice and sharp footage. You can see all the lines of the fence. You can even see the, the leaves on the trees. Although I don't feel this does the unit massive justice, um, it is quite good footage and some of the best that I've seen on YouTube. So please feel free to ask me any questions if you need to. This is just a little bit of footage pasted in, but hopefully it's sufficient enough for you guys to get a good idea of the sort of quality you're going to get from the unit. Um, but just as kind of a follow-up review, I've used it. I've mounted it to a helmet, I bought the Skull Crusher flip down lid that from Armasite. Um, I got it from Optics Planet, it cost me about $100 into the UK, about £100. It's a full Skull Crusher with the mount on the front, it's perfect, fits in a backpack um, and, and it's, it's a really great bit of kit. So, um, well done Armasite, great unit. Um, hopefully this video will come up on YouTube because I've seen lots of kind of bad comments on the videos that you know try and show night vision through it. It is difficult for me to say without showing you, but I will try and get a video at some point through it um, and show you some footage. So um, that's the Armasite Spark Core. It's kind of a bit of an update on where I am with it and, and you know that I'm really impressed with it and what Armasite have managed to deliver so much technology for so cheap. Thank you very much for watching. If you do have any questions on this, please feel free to let me know um, and just drop me a message or a comment and I will make sure that I get back to you. So uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you all soon. Mm.